Hi, I'm Annette Patko, owner of Bordeaux Studio here in Evanston, and the Evanston Chamber has started a series called Water Cooler Chats, where we check in with our local business owners to see what they're up to during this time. And today we're talking to Chris Bailey, um, agency owner at Farmers Insurance Agency here in Evanston. How are you, Chris? I'm hanging in there. How are you doing today? I'm good. I'm, I like your farmer's insurance sign in the back. Now that we're on Zoom, we have to yeah. be environmental conscious of what's behind us. Branding. It's branding. branding. And, yes. and it's the first thing people see when they walk in my door. So kind of can't miss it, really. <laughs> right. Right. So how has this changed now for you, your office life? How is this changing your work day? Yeah. Yeah, I, and I think I had mentioned before that I'm kind of joking with clients uh, each day saying that I get to choose the music that plays in my office, which I'm enjoying. Uh, I get to listen to my uh, my 90s nostalgia. Um, oh, that's what you listen to, okay. I'm yeah. a country girl, so I listen to my country music. Blast. There you go, <laughs> there you go. Um, but uh, as far as my team, they're working remotely. I'm, I'm here basically in case of any mail that needs to be picked up, but also um, any any packages and things that for, for my office, but there are no walk-ins. We are encouraging clients to do things temporarily by phone and yes. email and invoice chat. Yes, to keep it safe. Ex absolutely. For, for sure. So how about um, some new projects? What are you working on? I'm sure you're busy now with all the flooding and the rains that are, have been happening. Yeah, it's, it's, it's been unprecedented as far as the, the amount of claims we've been seeing and, and supporting, uh, thankfully, here at at farmers, but it's a lot of um, it's a lot of uh, water issues right now. Is kind of taking up our time. That's yes. mm -hmm. that's been a project, but it, we're handling it, and it, and it comes with a little bit of later working hours, taking calls throughout the entire weekend, uh, being responsive as quick as possible. Um, I have a saying that I don't leave until my inbox is at zero, and that's oh, true. Nice. Oh wow! Okay. Yeah, yeah. So I hope I, late I hours sometimes then. Uh, yeah, I was yeah. I was here until I was here until ten o'clock on on Friday. Just oh taking wow. Yeah, we, we don't need this flooding on top of whatever thing else that's going on for sure. Right? You right. Know, I, I, I'm just like everybody else. I want my rates to stay down. I don't want them to go up. Yes, right. So, so. what are you um, specializing in as far as insurance? You're covering everything, auto, car, home? Yeah, yeah, really yes. a full service suite of things we do here. Everything on the business insurance side to uh, from commercial insurance to also personal lines insurance. Um, I also... Uh, I am six and sixty-three investment license, so I also help with some financial services components for clients. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, so I help with in that respect. Um, yeah, so we do we do quite a bit here, and I tell clients that if you're having a, a hard time getting a solution for your insurance, uh, mm -hmm. we have yet to turn anybody away. We find okay. a package, and we can actually design policies from scratch too. If if somebody has, oh, wow. a, yeah, if somebody has like a goofy risk, for example, something that may not be traditional, we actually can source. A, a carrier outside of farmers sometimes um, to design a policy from the ground up for a unique or special risk. All right. So you do business insurance too? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Awesome. So for our business owners in Evanston. Yeah. Actually, I, love it. I actually love it because it, it breaks up the monotony for me. Uh, home mm -hmm. and auto and other things are surely a backbone of right. what keeps the business running, but commercial gets me excited. Awesome. And, so how about on a personal level, how are you keeping calm during this time or doing some kind of self-care or hobby that came up during this epidemic? Yeah, I'm kind of a tinkerer. I'm kind of a handyman around the house. So I've taken, a, I've taken this time to basically touch up all the painting in my house. Okay. Uh, it's cathartic for me to just maybe pop on a podcast and start painting and just seeing the improvement yeah. inside the house. If I'm going to be in the house more, I might as well have it look a little bit nicer. <laughs> okay, yes, yes. So, so a lot of us probably, because we're more at home, we're seeing all the different projects that we should be doing right now. Yeah. Um, and then, you know, in terms of other projects here at the office, um, you know, I was actually uniquely built for this, I think. Uh, not every agency, I think, has some of these capabilities. But um, in advance of this, about a year ago, I made a significant investment in my office to uh, have both remote backup servers uh, VPN. Oh, wow. yes. I have client. I have access to my client files even if I'm working from home. Awesome. Um, mm -hmm. Which is not something that farmers requires me to do. Okay. It's just the thing that I did because I thought it would be the right thing to do. Yes. Yeah. Well, and this time you invested in the future because we don't know how long this is going to take or if it's going to come back. So you're all set for any kind of situation. Good for you. Dividends, you know, to be able to grab a client file digitally, you know. Yes. I'm having old fashioned dusty files. I actually can get something on a weekend. Um, I know other agencies are not built for that and they're, they're struggling a little 
bit. And, and I, I do talk to other agents about you know, how they're handling these things. Um, yes. I think I've kind of opened their eyes as far as let's, let's go digital because that's the way to go right now yeah. in this space. Yeah, that's a good part. That's the Chamber of uh, Commerce and Evanston's also set up that way so we can work remote and we can log into the computers in the Chamber office. So it's really good that the Chamber still keeps working and uh, supporting all our members. So thank you for being a member. Thank you for talking to us today. And um, if you have any insurance needs, uh, contact Chris Bailey at the Chris Bailey office here in Evanston. And I will post a link to your office in this post. That'd be great. Thank all you right. for taking the time. And have a good thank one. Thank you. Good to see you, Chris. Good to see you. See you soon, hopefully, at one of our meetings. Great. Okay.